Hello friends, it is Wednesday, March 8th, I am technically still in my spring break because I had a week between terms and then it was spring break and next week will be the start of the term but my professor for my new class released the course early so we could get a head start which Shout out to her because it looks like I'm going to be doing just as much reading. I am basically going to be reading this entire textbook. Thankfully, the chapters are pretty short. Like, the first chapter was maybe 10 pages. The chapter I just read was 9 pages. Um, yeah, so I'm not too worried about it, but I am reading like 4 chapters a week, so it's kind of annoying. But um, I already like this class. All I've read was the first two chapters of the textbook and like the objectives for module one or week one or whatever and I already like it. Um, it's This class is counseling the culturally diverse or like yeah like diverse populations or whatever and it's so interesting like the first chapter of this book was literally, literally just the authors being like hey this class and this book is going to make you really uncomfortable because it's going to make you think about things that you don't want to think about it's going to make you question your morals because we live in a society where being morally just is important but oftentimes we have unintentional biases towards gender and race most often and a lot of non-minority people get offended because this class in this book makes them think about things that they have done that may have been um, racially biased and they don't like feeling like they did something wrong but the point of the class isn't to make you feel upset it's to point out those biases so that you can make the changes necessary to be more culturally competent in the future and i love that um also i was thinking as i was reading i'm only in my second class and i'm only two chapters into my second class and I already feel more, I already feel like I have more direction. Um, the first class I took made me realize that I would prefer to work with groups rather than individuals. And I would rather, I think, work on the community level rather than the like therapeutic level, if that makes sense. Like I'd rather work with like helping communities gain their footing to be more sustainable with their um, support system, if that makes sense. And then this, literally two chapters in, is making me realize that I need to, if I want to work with populations and communities, I need to increase my cultural competence, um, which I'm pretty culturally competent, but we can always continue to improve. Like. Nobody can be the epitome of cultural competence. So I'm really excited. I'm very excited. <sighs> that is the update for now. See you guys tomorrow. Hello beautiful people, it is officially day one of term two. Like I said before, my professor opened the term or opened the course materials a week early. So I have already read all of the material for this week and done the assignments, which were just like introductory assignments. So they didn't really have anything to do with the reading. Um, and I am starting the week two materials. I already read. Excuse me. I already read one of the five or four chapters, so I'm gonna start the like PowerPoints and module materials now. And hopefully I can keep this sort of week ahead groove going. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing now.
I really like this book, by the way. I don't know if I... I don't know if I mentioned it in the last clip, but this book... If you follow me on Instagram, I've been posting stuff from the book. It's so good. They're really, they really are calling out the white therapists, but they are mentioning how um, minority therapists might also have some biases. It's really good. I like it. Yeah, that's what's going on today. See you later. Hello friends, I'm not sure what the last clip you saw was, but today is Friday, March 17th, 8.03 p.m. This morning I finished my implicit bias essay, so I had already turned in the activity I told you guys about, and then I had to write a paper on implicit bias, and I did that, and that's actually not due until the 26th, so I'm 10 days ahead. Shout out to me. I'm actually one whole week ahead, like one full week ahead. And I'm starting the chapters for not next week, but the week after. So hopefully I can get it done. Um, it's five chapters this time and there's another paper that goes along with it. But I have a ton of time to do it, so I'm not worried. Um, this term, this class, I like it a whole lot better. One, I love the content. Two, I love that it's self-paced. So like I'm a week ahead. My last class, I couldn't be a week ahead because the quizzes open up at a certain time and I didn't want to, like, confuse myself by continuing through the reading and, like, all that stuff. So that's really exciting. Um, I got a summer job. We're in spring right now, but I got a job teaching reading to K through, K through 9 students. Um, it's actually hosted on UCF campus which is really amazing. So, yeah, that's really cool. Um, I actually just got offered the job today. I went through three different interview processes, so it's really cool. Yeah, I just wanted to update you on the vibes. Like, I'm, I'm literally just reading. That's really all that... So far, this is all the master's program has given to me. I've only taken two classes, though. I was telling my mom the other day, I was like, she's like, how's school going? Then I was like, you know... When I imagined like going to higher education, like graduate school, I imagined it being like really like thought heavy and like I had to use my brain a lot. And yeah, I'm like learning things and I'm thinking critically, but it's not as difficult as I thought it was. Like I thought I would have to like do a lot of problem solving for some reason, but really what I'm just doing is like reading, watching, writing, and that's it. So going cool going fine going great oh I'm also taking a Google course so yeah that's going great too I can finish one quote-unquote week of the course in about a day it takes me like about an hour to get through like a week's course and there's seven units and each unit is four weeks so it'll they say that it'll take you between three and six months I'm aiming for three or less so yeah, that's what I've been up to. See you later.